Remember the good old innocent days when swinging was something kids did at a playground? Well, what was yesterday's child's play is today's adult entertainment. Swinging is now a term meaning recreational social sex and partner swapping. To many, this represents the ultimate breakdown in morality. But according to Dr. Robert McGinley, it's something more and more people are doing. Swinging is growing very rapidly here in the United States. Indeed, when we look at who the swingers are, we find this is middle class America. Well, uh, you've, you've been there, been around. Uh, what do you mean? Well, uh, you've, uh, you've like, well, you know, you've, uh, you've done it. You've, uh, you've slept with a, uh, you slept with a lady. Yes. What's it like? <laughs> Dr. McGinley is himself a staunch advocate of swinging. He claims university studies have found it actually makes for a happy and healthy marriage, and not a destroyed one. Rather than destroy the family, the research that we have seems to indicate that swinging is the the family. It does away with a lot of social game play and a lot of role playing that people get into in the so-called traditional way of living. But sometimes it's hard to know what to do when you don't know who you're talking to. Dr. McGinley says there are over 200 swing clubs in the United States, informal groups that meet for what they call recreational sex. To try to inform people about swingers and swinging, Dr. McGinley founded the North American Swing Club Association, NASCA for short. Through NASCA, Dr. McGinley hopes to legitimize swinging. We're having a party. Everybody's swinging. Stop that, that's filth. Many may view NASCA as one more connection between modern America and the declining Roman Empire, but the psychologist and sex counselor disagrees. I don't see this as a decline. I see it as a humanistic uh, development that can only speak well for our future. It's estimated between 3 and 20 million Americans engage in this activity. But the majority of people are probably not ready to get into what Dr. McGinley feels is the swing of things. Are you tired? Are you uninspired? If you're bored, you just can't afford to miss out on the scene. I turn on my little swinging machine. Produced by Frank Guida. I'm Tom Powell on the News Blimp.